What color is his hat? Hey guys, welcome back to Harrison Hacks. Uh, today I'm just going to be showing you a few more things uh, you can do with the Arcade Classic Edition. Uh, in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can add an intro video, you can add remove games, as well as you can place the build on a different drive other than C, and I'll show you how to go about doing that and have everything run perfectly on another drive letter. Uh, so first thing we're going to do is let's do the add intro video. So I'm going to open my Arcade Classic Edition folder and I'm going to go into the intro folder. So there's no intro video. <clears throat> Excuse me. Then I'm going to go over to where I have a video I want to use for my intro. I'm just going to use my son here. I'll copy and paste that there. And it must be uh, an MP4 file. As far as I know, this is what I've always used. So a .mp4 video file. Uh, named intro.mp4. So I'm just going to show the file extensions. So there we go, intro.mp4. So once you have that in your intro folder, we're going to launch our Arcade Classic Edition. And you can see we didn't have an intro. So I'm just going to mute. So we're going to hit tab on the keyboard. And we're going to go up to intro <clears throat> and we're going to go play intro change it from no to yes press enter now we'll escape escape and we're going to exit out and then let's launch it back up and there we go so that's just my brief uh, little intro video there that i put in there is sound, like I said, I just muted the computer. Uh, the other thing um, I want to do is show you guys how to add or remove games. So you can see I don't have three count bout in the build. So I'm going to exit out. And we're going to go and open our main folder. ROMs. And I have my three count bout dot zip. And I'm just going to move it over there. There we go. So just remember that this is MAME 0.192. That's the version of MAME we're running. So make sure that your ROMs are compatible. Um, and you'll have to find your ROMs online. Uh, they're pretty easy to find with a Google search. Also, you know, maybe somebody left the entire ROM set there. I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you guys. Um, so... Basically what we're going to do is start it up after we've added our ROMs. So I added three count bout. So there's my intro. And there is three count bout. So I'll just launch it for you real quick. So one, uh, one nice thing that I want to say about this build uh, when you move it to a different drive is it's very easy to do <clears throat> to uh, you just got to edit one config file and you're good to go and there we go so I'm gonna exit out of there and now lastly I'm gonna show you guys how to put it onto a different drive so you're gonna wanna take your arcade classic edition and instead of cut and paste, I recommend copy, make sure copy and paste, and then make sure that everything's fully working for you before you go ahead and delete your C drive version. Um, so I'm just going to do it into the root of H. And as you can see, I've already done it, Arcade Classic Edition. All you would do is just copy, put it on whatever drive letter you want, doesn't matter, as long as it's in the root, the same as on your C drive, it's in the root. And then we would just right click. And paste it there but I've already had I already have it done so next thing we're gonna want to do we're gonna close out C and whatever new drive letter you have it on go into your arcade classic edition folder go into the emulators folder 
and you're going to have this mame.cfg file. So we're going to want to open this with Notepad++. Uh, if you don't have it, you can go to a Google search and get that. It's an awesome little program. So we'll right click, edit with Notepad++. And this is really easy to do, guys. So on the executable line, you'll see it has us going to the C drive. So my drive is H. So I'm going to delete the C, put an H. For the ROM path, I'm going to do the same. H. And for the artwork flyer, which is our box art, I'm going to delete the C, put an H. Make sure you hit save. And that's it. So let's, let's try this out. Close it. And I'm going to launch it from my H drive. There it is, fully working. And we'll just launch Batman just real quick. Just to show you that everything is working perfectly. As usual, it takes forever to boot when I'm recording, but uh, you know, I, I gotta work with what I got. And there we go. So now it's working on a different drive letter. So uh, real quick, I, I want to give you guys an update. I've been working on something, um, a huge build. I mean, a, a really massive build. Um, and it, I'm, I'm in the early stages. And I'm, keep your eye out for uh, the vintage collection preview. And it's just a work in progress right now. Uh, I got a whole bunch of stuff going on in there um, that I'm not going to get into in this video. Uh, but basically, it is my latest build, and it's going to be the biggest build I have ever done. And uh, I'm just hoping everyone's going to enjoy it. And like I said, keep your eye out for the preview video. That should be coming uh, in the near future, just to give you guys an idea of the work in progress. And, you know, maybe you can give me your comments and thoughts on what you think of it. Uh, and I'll go a little more into detail uh, in that video. So again, guys, as always, I really appreciate you watching. I hope this helped. Uh, please like the video, uh, subscribe to the channel, and most importantly, have a good day.